What up everyone? I hope you can hear me okay. I am at the Chicago airport right now. Today is gonna be the best day ever because I am having a DCP reunion with two of my roommates. So the first one that I am seeing here pretty shortly because she's picking me up from the airport is Molly. And you guys will recognize Molly from my Disney World vlogs and also my DCP reunion that we did last year in New York City. And that was actually the last time I saw Molly. So I haven't seen Molly in like a year and four months. So I'm very sad, but I'm so excited to see her here in a few minutes. And we are in Chicago because we are meeting up with Isabel and you will recognize Isabel from my DCP vlogs from Disney World and Disneyland. She's my roommate at both programs. We are meeting up with Isabel because she actually just moved here to the city, which is super exciting. And I'm very excited for her to show us around. And I hope you guys enjoy this travel video but also Disney video. Yes, my two favorites. Love it. Hi, I love you. So cute. Okay, so update Molly and I. Hello. So we cool. are are we in Chicago? Yeah, we're in Chicago. We're just like not in the city yet. We're not in the city part of Chicago, but we made a little pit stop on the way to the Airbnb. Yes. Because yes. we're going to see the birthplace of Walt Disney. We're going to see the house he was born in and lived in. He was literally born in this house. I can't believe floor. it. On the second floor. Like literally in the house. I can't, I cannot believe it. I wonder it. if it's like We don't know if corner? it's open or not or like what the yeah. deal is. We can just walk past it and like say we saw it. Exactly. Picture in front of it, that'd be fine. We gotta get a little Disney in on this trip. So. Yeah, right? Exactly. Oh, there's a sign. That's it. <gasps> there's a sign. Oh my God, there's a sign. <laughs> it's literally like in the middle of this you go random neighborhood. You go Walt Disney inside. birthplace restoration project the house that's so cool it's, a, it's gonna be a historic landmark Aww, I love like, it. this is really freaking cool <laughs> I'm scared. we're in multi yard what do we do are you allowed to go in should we call someone <laughs> I'm scared I, I, just, I just said yeah because like there's like a lock thing on the door so I don't think you can get in I don't want to just like walk in <laughs> Aww. it's just construction oh they're still working on it okay so they're still restoring it obviously but this is where Walt was born. Might as well just try it. It's locked. Aw, <laughs> oh, dang it. Shucks. <laughs> so this is his home that he was born in. He was born on the second floor here, which is totally wild to think about. Yeah, actually the house is really big. I was not expecting that. This must be new. See how it's like different colors? Oh, yeah. That must be an add-on. Maybe? Maybe, yeah. Oh, there's a little yard. So it's really cool to be at Walt Disney's birthplace, but it's also a little bit sad because it's not done and it doesn't look like there's anybody working on it. I think they ran out of money. <laughs> where's like, I think like, they ran out of money. Like Bob Iger? Like, he should be donating money. That's what I'm saying. Like, Bob, where are you at? If they can spend so much money on all these new things, like your, cre your boss, like your creator, I know. the creator. But I'm kind of surprised just because <laughs> everything at Disney is like so very well taken care of and this is Walt's birthplace and i know they have like a whole thing in yeah. what's it called um in marceline like yeah they have like a lot of they have like yeah a whole bunch of stuff but dedicated like to him yeah but i guess this isn't high on the bucket also, list for them but the outside looks really nice i think you can definitely tell they started restoring it but they just they haven't finished honorary disney family avenue it's just in the middle of this cute little neighborhood i love it there's walt's house Okay, so we made it to our Airbnb, and it's actually pretty cute. It's in like the basement, and there's like several rooms in here. But look, so they have different rooms, and like all the guests who are staying. And our room is like down here, so it's a shared bathroom in the hallway. Molly's in there now. And then there's like a little couch here. And then when you come down the hallway, you have our room, and we're staying in the color cave. And it's legit a cave. I gotta give you a tour. Okay, here we go. Hello, come on in. Oh, this is as far as the door goes. Cool. <laughs> okay, welcome to our crib. My name is Molly and I'm your host. First, we'll take you over to the living room. We have a nice, like, big, comfy couch, like, so much room space. for some activity. Look at all the space we have, like, the crib. Chillin'. Now we're going to the bedroom. Oh look, we're here. Oh, look. We're here already. It's so nice. So you just like, you just 
hang out down here. It's so cozy. In our literal cave. It's a cave. Our king size bed it's in a literal cave. cave. <laughs> the reason we picked this one is because it had a king size bed. Yes. And don't forget our view. One of a kind. <laughs> Twenty dollars. <laughs> totally worth it. Thanks for coming to our room tour. <laughs> okay, guess what? We are right in front of Wrigley Field. Ah, you can see the sign in the back there. And I hate the Cubs. <laughs> I don't really know anything about the Cubs, but Wrigley Field! Wait, 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 is this Disney World? Like, are we at Hogwarts? Yeah, I think that's the castle. I think this is Hogwarts. <laughs> that's the castle, right? Like Harry yeah, Potter. That's where they play Quidditch. Oh, yeah. Oh, we're at the Quidditch Field. Makes sense. So we're at Wrigley Field. Ooh, Just checking it out. Oh. Winds, yes. Mm -hmm. Angles. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> And uh, we're just waiting on Isabel. We're about to meet up with her. She's on the train on her way over. So we're gonna hang with her when she gets here. We're all going to dinner, super exciting. So I can't wait. Look who we found. It's me. So happy. And now we're eating at this really yum restaurant. Okay, all right. What did you get? I got, it's not vegan. That's okay. I got a chicken, chicken ranch wrap. Yeah. The French fries that are really good. What did you get? I got tofu scram with a side of vegan cheddar. It looks so freaking good. And then I got the Ooh. Santa Fe vegan scram. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Hey everyone, so uh, we're back in our color cave. <laughs> and <laughs> Molly and I are going to practice hitting the quan because it's our favorite thing that we yeah. used to do in Florida. So we're like We have to do it to reunite. Yeah, so let's play it. The jacket's gotta come off. It's so rusty. <laughs> play without music. It's like, so it's like, clean pair of sneaks with a designer belt. Please, please, please watch please yourself as I'm feeling myself. Put a flag on the play and somebody, somebody call the rep. And it's like, sun, 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 sun. yeah, that's good. And then that's it. And then, oh, then we hit the quan. Oh, yeah, we hit the classic quan. <laughs> Oh my god, my dream come true. Why do we do this every time we travel together? Welcome home, everyone. Oh my god, I need this. Do you think they make this in my size? <laughs> Fabulous. Oh god, I love the Disney store. So I decided I'm gonna get these and be Ariel for Halloween, because I already have a shirt that has like the purple seashells on it, so I'll just wear this and this, and hello, Halloween. And they're on clearance, so it's perfect. Your gum nigga is hot. Oh yeah. <laughs> it's literal dull whip. We cannot get away from Disney. Dull whip is insane. Like, I'm so happy. Like, I don't even think we're in Chicago anymore. I know. I think we're in Orlando. This is just turning into a giant Disney trip. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's the So freaking cool. We are in Millennium Park. Very pretty fall colors here. And we made so Also, it's raining, like, and it won't stop. Yeah, it won't. It won't stop. <laughs> Like every time it stops raining, so it starts rude. again. It is, it's so rude. Like we're just here to visit and have fun and I'm it's rainy. <laughs> Look, Molly, get the bean in the background. Look, it's the bean. <laughs> What's up? Oh my gosh, the reflection is so cool. Hello everyone, still with Molly. Just to let you guys know, we have not done much. After Millennium Park, we went and had lunch at Panera and then we couldn't think of anything to do for like an hour. 
so <laughs> we ended up walking one block to target it was so cold outside and like my shoes are kind of wet so my toes are freezing so we came into target so that i could buy socks and gloves because it's so cold and we haven't left and we haven't <laughs> left we've been here for like an hour and a half now and we're just like sitting in the book section reading and I'm reading Cole and Sav's book. Oh my god, I love them. They're like some of my favorite YouTubers and really good book. Love it. So now we're probably gonna head back and start walking towards the car with my warm socks that I'm about to buy. And then I gotta go. I gotta go back to the airport. So sad. It was such a short trip. So sad. Like yesterday we were like, oh my god, we're hanging out. We have tomorrow. And now we're like, we have to go. Where'd the time go? It's so sad. So that's about it. Our Chicago trip has come to an end. Super sad, but it was very fun. Mm -hmm. Even though today we're just sitting in Target reading. <laughs> we came to Chicago to go to Target. I feel like that's like a good representation of us. Because in Florida we were in Disney World, but we never left Vista Wait. Yeah. <laughs> so this is the norm for us. Yes. We're used to this. Yes. But we had so much fun and I can't wait to visit my friends again. Love it!